what we're trying to do with XD is build the next platform that's gonna help people build whole new careers and create new kinds of experiences that we can't even imagine today. XD was built from the ground up and it is very performant. What's different about building a product from scratch is that you get to imagine anything and that's scary. You're basically designing for designers. There's not every company that is doing that, right? The way it started was us just kind of tossing around ideas for, hey, if we wanted to build like a really nice, lightweight feeling, vector-based design tool, what would we put in it? If we're building something from scratch, we can take the time to reevaluate everything. Go back to the beginning and see is there a better way for us to rethink that problem and solve it. Why are there two selection tools? Why do you need layers? And obviously not every single thing is worth doing that, but for some things I think it is really important. And when you go do that and you get it right, it's just cool. Really they just want a platform that works systematically and that works together. And Adobe is the only one that can do that for them. The entire team is using XD to build XD. It definitely helps us to be in the product every day, building the product, because we are users too, so we're with you. So when people suffer, we have a lot of empathy for them, because we've been like, oh, I just filed that bug. I got you, girl. Here we go! Designers are a very opinionated group. They, they definitely will let us know if we've, we've gone wrong or gone off the rails in some way. <laughs> We get some of our best feedback from the community. From the very beginning, we've been on this one-month delivery cycle where we try to push out a new version of the app every month. And then we can get feedback and iterate a lot more quickly than if we had you know, a six-month or a year-long development cycle. I don't think you can build these kinds of tools in isolation. It's a little bit egotistical to think that you can know what a community wants without being a part of the communities. It does feel as though we're at the beginning of something which is industry defining. Keeping the product simple is the sort of thing that keeps me up at night. <laughs> we're already thinking about how your job is going to change. And we've built a foundation that is going to support those changes, not just for the next six months, but for the next five, 10, 15 years. Design is not just about the visual aspects of a thing. It's really about the business strategy and it's about the way people experience it. And that's way more than pixels on a page. All we can say is that we've built a process. I feel like we've come to a really exciting place. I really hope that in like 20 years, we're like, you know, the, the Photoshop of today where people use it as a verb. <laughs> it's like, can you Photoshop that? I wish people would be like, can you XD that? Yes, that would be epic.